Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Icarus for another episode. It's been a while, I've been busy doing some other bits, uh, doing some tutorials and uh, information bits for my channel. Um, yep, so here we are back again in Icarus anyway. So, uh, but today I'm just going to do a bit more exploration, I think. Um, we've still got to go up here and just finish. Um, fleshing out this bit of the forest biome. Uh, we also found a tunnel through here into the um, desert biome. Um, and there's a scorpion there chasing us. That was a few sessions ago. But yeah, just want to finish expanding the, desert bi uh, the forest biome today. So let's go and have a sleep. Alright, let's just make sure we've got everything we need. We've got a full bottle of water, our oh, knife's good, our bow's good, our pickaxe could probably do with being repaired, um, we could do with some more ore, um, how are we doing on food generally, so we've got an oxide bottle, so that was the other thing we did last time, and we've got a farmer's satchel for storing seeds in. Um, Cream corn just consume that before it goes off. That will give us a bonus. Um, no, let's go. I think we're all good. Let, let's head out. And I need to head which way? I need to head north, north, west. I have some talent points to spend. I just seen. I forgot about that. One talent point available. Um, what do we want? What do we want? Got that, got that. That's a swift stalker. I'm not too fussed about that. Bone collector, no. Um, longer lasting effects. Food effects, duration lasts longer. Um, buffs from vegetable only foods are increased. Uh, gathering guru, no. Melee damage. Let's, let's take that one. I don't think we're solo, do I? No solo points. I know tech points, no. Right, north, north, east, this sort of way. Now I see there has been a new creature added as of today. Uh, Dribbleo or Dribbo or something like that. Um, um, sorry, saw them in the dark there. Yeah, so but in the desert biome, there's a new creature being added. They're also finishing expanding out the bits for the Prometheus um, map. Which uh, looks quite good. Oh, sorry, little one. Oh, I didn't know that was your mum. Actually, I probably should have taken a drink of water before I left, but there's a chance I'm going to get dysentery from this, isn't there? Because I changed that, that you can get dysentery now from. Um, Unclean rainwater where previously you couldn't. Can we get up here? Being lazy, can I get up? Yeah, there we go. Being really lazy, should have went the long way around, but I couldn't be bothered. Let's get some light on the scene, that'll help, won't it? We've got a long way to travel in this section, so I need to get a wiggle on. Um, I don't think I uploaded, I was making this video, I don't think I uploaded the last video. I have to go back and double check. I made it, I don't think I got around to uploading because I got distracted. Um, where are we on the map? Oh, not very far at all. Okay, so we want to just sort of head this way towards that. 
and there's my lander. Yeah, head this way towards the hills and then follow the hills up. A pack of wolves by the sounds of it. Should pick some offside up so we don't run out. No, I don't want carrots or just decay in my backpack for now. Oh, there's a wolf. There was a wolf. Again, I could pick up the pumpkins, but um, it just became a backpack for now, so I'm just going to move it. Follow this wall up and round, we actually take us to where we need to be. It also gives us a chance to see if there's any more caves. I believe there is a cave up here, but we've already been through it. Although I didn't have a metal, but I think I need a steel pickaxe to be able to harvest the uh, more exotic um, ores like uh, platinum and aluminium or aluminium for American friends. Right. If I remember correctly, the, the cave was... Oh, no, it was down here. I'm way past it. Okay. I've got to be careful there. Okay. Got it further than I thought. Now, I can take on most things now. Um, I've got a technique for getting bears as long as I've got enough room to move and as long as I'm not being attacked by anything else at the same time. So I'm not too fussed about the bears anymore. Um, they used to panic me like mad when I first played. I want to start playing this game because uh, I didn't know it would get kill them. Yeah, there we go, I've got dysentery. Is there anything on me to cure dysentery? Oh, I don't think you do, do you? No, it doesn't. Oh well, that was a waste. Nothing else? No. Uh, but yeah, so nowadays I have like the workout technique, you know, if you can just sidestep them, you can, um, sort of new target. You can, um, Most nine times out of ten, you can kill them before they they actually kill you. It's just all about timing. Side stepping before they can swipe at you. It doesn't take many swipes on them to actually kill you. Talking of side swiping, killing on my arm is fine. Good. Oh, two monkey berries. Never mind, I've got them now. Food while I'm doing food, so what can I to boost my stamina? I can consume you and consume you and also get a boost to my experience. Right, I must be getting close to this corner here, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then that's a deer just running away from me. And as I roll. I'll be back, uh, me arrow back, thank you. Um, it's baby deer, you're okay, I'm not going to go for baby deer. Not deliberately anyway, not unless I kill its mother. That's a large deer, he's always seen me, he's always running away. Although he's going to get stuck because, um, I don't know, he's going to run straight down the cliff face. Now, was that a deer groaning there or was that a bear? Sometimes it's hard to tell. Uh, 
How are we doing? It's in oxygen water, yeah, all okay, food all okay. We must be getting close, yeah we are, we're very close to where a deer with a baby deer and another deer and a pronghorn. Uh, look, that's on explore for the moment, I'm not going to be hunting too much. I know I've been killing things I've been running up here, but it's literally just as I've been in my path almost. So, let's go looking around here, what do we have? I've probably run past loads of caves, so I think we'll be looking for them. It's a bit silly, but I'm mine. Uh, what time of day is it? Oh, it's only 10 o'clock in the morning, that's good, we've got plenty of time. So this is one sweep of... Oh, that breath. Oh yeah, I think I think I've got to go down the proper way, it's a bit far to jump. Okay, so it's a bit bigger than I was expecting. Um, hit him. Thank you. Now, um, I am going to not to this in future look at taming some of these beasts. Um, I've done it once or twice in the past, but uh, it looks like the changes are made. Of, of look quite good now, so yeah, I'm seriously to thinking of uh, getting the beast of burden and not too distant future. Okay, the fox, uh, there's a wolf over there and a chamois over there I think it was. Oh, here's another little lake. And what's that over there? So let's just head around this way. I don't think I've ever actually been to this lake. That sounded like a deer. Where am I? Okay, so there's something up here. Yeah, there he is. Boo! So what's up here? Have I been around here before? It doesn't feel familiar, that's a thing. Okay, so that's another little opening up there. Okay, well, I'll just look around here now we're here. Nothing. No oh, wolf. Sorry. You were, um, this is about to attack me. Oh, they're ready. So yeah, I don't, yeah, I definitely don't think I've been at this before. Like I don't remember any of this, so... It's a bit of an exploration. It's a bit bigger than I was expecting, to be honest. I thought it was just a little area around the corner. But then it turned into a quite a bit bigger area around the corner than I was expecting. Oh wow, that goes on much further than I was expecting. 
And it's this way, really, don't we? What time of day is it? 11 a.m. Another leg. So where? Oh, okay, that leads around into a desert biome by the looks of it. So if we head down towards the lake, we'll follow it round. Hello, dear. Hey, what's this one? This is, this is, this is... Salt. Okay, I'm give this one salt. Food okay? Yeah, how are we doing water? Oh, we're getting a little low. Do I risk it? Do I risk it? Ooh, I regret this. Oh no, not too bad. Okay, and yeah, and here's a desert biome. At the start of the desert biome, anyway. Mm -hmm. What are you? You wolf. Or use something else. Not sure. All right. So okay, I don't want to go too far into there today. As yeah, so. a wolf standstill, missed him. I'm going to look sixty-one. That's fine. Is that wolf what? I didn't I miss that I'll see it in playback. Was that wolf killer or something like that? Oh that's narrow there. And you Are you going to run away or are you going to attack me? Attack me. Oh, that was my bit. I couldn't get my... Um... Oh, no. Yeah, I couldn't get my... Um, the right weapon. Bones. Where's your mate gone? Let's get him. There's still a wolf in the stream as well. Is that all of them? Is that all the ones I got? Alright. Oh, he's drunk in the stream, should have done that. Never mind. I needed water. Mm 
That was a spear doing. It's a bit worse for wear. Get up. Okay, so what is round here? And out of food again. It'd be better if we could just stick like a stack of food in and it just consumes them one after the other. <laughs> Okay, so this is the top here. So, I need to go back around this bit here and so just run around here, make sure there's nothing worth. I can hear. I can hear you. You've got a baby, behave. Ooh, this might be useful. I know you're going to do that. You're a huh? Why would you do that when you've got a baby in tow? Hey? Why? Leave me, Mum, not me. I wasn't going to touch her. <coughs> Stand still. Go <coughs> for that. You're killing your Mum. Where is everyone there? Yeah, so this is an oxide uh, deep vein. It's just a shame it's so far from my base. Although I may end up. Um, I can hear lots of things around me. I may end up building a little base up here for um, trips into the desert biome. So this might be a good place to build. I just got to remember it's up this bit here where the oxide is. Yeah, that's really useful. What are you? You're a rabbit. Okay. I'll let you off. Yeah, boo, go away. I'm trying to explore, not kill. That was the old me, and this is a new me. At this point, uh, my laptop decided to crash or the Unreal Engine decided to crash. I was able to save the video up to the point it went blank there previously um, and then recover from a little bit just before that. However, in doing so my microphone decided to mute itself, <laughs> which is a bit annoying. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you some highlights from the rest of this bit of video. There's no commentary over the top of it unfortunately. Um, I literally just explored the rest of this bit of land um, down to the uh, at the north east and turned around and made my way back to my base there's nothing really epic happened it was just really exploration more exploration uh, similar to what had been done in the first part I did manage to um, take down a few animals I also managed to go up a level and um, I will cut in the selection of talent points and text so you can see what I actually picked. But from my guys, this is for me. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll let the video run.
so this is the back of my base. Um, I'm just going to decide what tech I want to pick. I believe I push pony. Then I talk about uh, some of the bits and pieces looking at the lantern and things like this. Um, then I realise that the latest update uh, allowed for pistols to move from tier 3 to tier 2 single shot pistols, and that's what this is here. Um, I thought to be able to build that I need um, refined wood, I think it is. Um, but to do that, I need to unlock the carpet to bench. Which is what I do, then I come back and um, I pick the lantern, I believe is the next thing. And it's a lantern that runs off animal fat rather than the torch. And it just replaces the torch, it burn a bit brighter, the burn a bit longer. Um, I was also looking there, trying to work out where biofuel was. Uh, the biofuel maker is a level 3 item, or tier 3 item. I'm um, also only tier 2 at the moment, so I can't make that. So, uh, yeah, I come back. So I was thinking the lamp would need biofuel, but it wasn't that sort of really stopped and red. But it said, I realised it needed animal fat, not biofuel, so I select that. After pulling all the parts together I need to build the carpentry bench, I build it. I then look at building the lantern, which needs some animal fat. Just clicking here so I can kick that off. It also needs some um, epoxy, I think it is. Yeah, epoxy, animal fat, iron. And to get the epoxy, you can make it from bone, so I crush a load of bone at this point. Realising I didn't quite have enough crushed bone, I make some more, just so I've got enough to make the epox uh, necessary amount of epoxy. And then I make the epoxy. Once that's done, I go back to my workbench and go grab some iron. Realise I got the wrong bench. And go to the right bench, and then, then make the lantern. That can now just go into my light slot on my hot bar. I was trying to work out how to fill it here. I didn't realise it was actually full. The bar along the bottom, the white bar along the bottom, tells me it's full. But I didn't click when I was first doing it. I was trying to work out how to fill it. realise what I've done wrong, turned it on and you can see it throws off a lot more light than the wooden torches do. It actually lights up the whole room quite well. And I was just dumping some bits in here so I can make some more uh, rendered animal fat.
and just decided to crush some more bones so that next time I need some poxy, I don't have to worry about it. I've got plenty of bone in my cupboard, so I'm just sorting bits out, making sure everything is tidy. And now I'll come back into my base just to find check the last few things. Um, and this is pretty much the end of the video here guys. So thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe. Please leave in the comment below. I will be releasing more Icarus videos. So I'll make sure that they record properly this time. Um, I don't know why I had the crash I did. It was a bit frustrating. Um, but to be honest, a lot of it was just running around what you missed. So you didn't miss too much. Uh, thanks for watching. Dragonfly Gamer wishing you good night.